Hello. I just realized that my hair is a bigger mess than I thought it was. Oh well. It is what it is. Let me pull this closer to me and Hi, Heather. Hello, friend. Heather, I'm making you a mod. Oh, hello. <laughs> uh, hopefully the stream is coming through just fine for you guys. I know this is a bit of a delay. There's Jess. <laughs> She's going to remove and report. <coughs> no, I won't do that to you, friend. All right, and moderator, I'm going to, okay, switch to, oh man, I can't switch to ultra low latency now. Well, that's not gonna matter. Okay, well, hopefully things aren't too far behind. So how are you guys today? By the way, I got this set up so I could switch between like a card cam and um, and a face cam here. So we're all set up. Hey, starter Pokemon, how's it going? Yeah, I'm coming through really, really quiet. I'm not sure why. Give me a minute to fix that. I'm just gonna go in here and uh, edit my filters, fix my game. Okay, let me know if that fixed it. Do I sound any better? Okay, yeah, for some reason it's not picking up my snowball, so give me a second here to fix that. I'm just gonna keep adding to my game until you guys can hear me just fine, even if that's probably gonna sound a little awkward. Uh, filters. Uh... Alright, I'm maxing out the uh, gain, so hopefully you guys can hear me just fine. Oh, it's okay, Heather. Awesome. So yeah, I had to just max out my game basically. All right, cool. So we're gonna set this up over here so I can just see my... Perfect. Awesome. Yeah, for some reason it's not always uh, good about picking up on my, um, my actual mic over here, so it's probably just picking up from over here. So I just literally just maxed out my game so that you can see what I'm doing. So good to go. Yes, sounds fine. How's the new place? Um, yeah, it's pretty good. 
Uh, more room than I expected. It's uh, on the fifth floor, so I'm pretty high up now. I'm actually looking out um, out the window to uh, see all the buildings and stuff. It's it's not the best view, but it is what it is. And previously, I was kind of in an underground level. But uh, you know, I'm gonna switch over to this um, other one here, so you guys can see that um, glorious, glorious base set boost uh, booster pack I have going on over there. And of course, I got me this Sun and Moon Ultra Prism booster box that we're gonna be opening up here today. So yeah, we'll get started with that here in just a bit. Um, whenever you guys actually want me to start opening up packs, I'll uh, I'll start opening up the uh, this booster box, and we can chit chat and open packs at the same time. <laughs> uh. I wish there wasn't such a delay. Oh dear. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Let's see if we can get this open. Uh, this is the first time I've actually bought two booster boxes of a set, but I really, really like this set. And my last box was pretty average. Yeah, let's get going. If I can get that open. Oh dear. By the way, I also have a glass of water chilling over here. I'm gonna move that a little farther away from the edge so I don't actually make a mess. And uh, this is actually the hardest I've ever had taking um taking some wrappings off, but yeah, there we are. Oh man, I love that fresh. You ever know the feeling? You guys know the feeling when you um <laughs> open into a fresh new booster box. It's great. And uh, Heather, how's um life been treating me? Um, pretty good. Actually, it's actually, I'm actually uh, been in a pretty good mood lately. I feel a lot better um, than I have been in a while. I haven't had as much stress and anxiety, so, which is always good. So, we're going to do this, oh, I said we're going to do this four packs at a time. We'll do one of each art. So that way we can just have ourselves a good old time. You got your snack and drink ready for Epic Stream. More ready for yours than what I did mine. <laughs> um, well, it is what it is. Things happen. I just already had a setup like this because I did that paint stream, so I had all of it already uh, um, more or less uh, set up. I just had to hook everything back up. Anyways, so yeah. Which one should I open up first? Should I go with uh, Leafeon, Giratina, uh, let's see, Don Wings, Necrozma, or Don Main, Dusk Main? Necrozma. Those things, like, try saying that five times fast, guys. Just just let me know how it works out for you. <laughs> Duskmane, Duskmane. That's a good one to start off with. So we got our four packs over there. Let's get this thing opening. Leafeon. Well, we're already going that way. We'll go with Leafeon next. Anyway, so let's start off. All right, so code card for you guys who are watching for codes. I want to make sure you can see that. So, there you go. And guess what? That's a good code. So, And I'm going to have to watch my screen for this because I don't have one, two, three, and four to the front since um, <laughs> obviously I don't have the little demo on my thing. There's two Leafeons coming next in your box. Well, let's see. I already got the uh, regular Leafeon. If I can get the full art and the secret rare version or the hyper rare version, I'd be pretty excited about that. So, uh, let's see if we can get Leaf Energy. Uh, no, no, no. I never do that anymore, but, you know, it is what it is. So, let's see what we're getting. Magneton. And I'm sorry about the, um, the zooming, but, like, this uh, webcam just is not as good as my, um, my actual camera. So, you know, it's gonna, the zoom's gonna be a little off. Uh, or the, rather, the focus, sorry, not the zoom. Wow, that's where I am. And our, ooh, we're starting off with a reverse. We actually already have this in reverse. This was not as quite as nice as my other one because the other one actually has the, um, the holographic pattern actually is on the um, picture itself. So it's really nice. It's like hollow all the way through. Oh, coming next to your box. Oh, yeah, there is two Leafeons coming in my next box, but I'm going to be separating them out. Now, let's see what we get. We're starting off with a Magmortar Holographic. Very nice. already have this one, but still, it's a very cool card. Let me set this aside. By the way, I am out 
of sleeves. So, and I didn't have the extra cash to buy any sleeves today. So, I'm just going to have to set them aside and keep them safe until I can go out and get some sleeves next weekend. But we're going to do the Leafy on pack art next. So, let's get going with this. By the way, what is your guys' uh, favorite card in this set so far? Um, I'm not sure what my my favorite is, 100%, but um, there's quite a few good ones. So, guess the energy game. We're going to go with Darkness Energy this time. No, Psychic Energy. So, Alright, so we got a Psychic. Yes. Luxio. A Skateboard. Mount Coronet. Eevee. A Lolan Vulpix. A Lolan Diglett. Shinx. Yanma. Our versus a Turtwig. That's very cute. I, I really like how for the um, the starters, they don't have like a like a real background. They just kind of have this stylized background for all these ones. I don't know. It's pretty neat. And our rare... It oh! oh my god! guys oh my god <laughs> there it is a golden ticket right there I know we should have started with the on oh my god <laughs> oh Jesus that's oh yeah and special shout out to oh of a to poke vault because I bought this box from him oh my god oh my god this this pretty much paid for the box it's like isn't this like a $70 card Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ, I am just <laughs> I'm gonna need a second to calm myself down. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. <laughs> oh my god, you guys are good luck. You guys are such a good luck. I want you guys around whenever I open up packs from now on. Because that, that, oh my god, oh my god. It's gonna keep you, like, right here. Oh my god. Actually, how, it, ooh, it's, uh, the, unfortunately, the cut isn't great, so that's kind of sad, but. Alright, we're gonna <laughs> kind of leave, leave them over there. We're just gonna grab the next pack over, and let's see what we can get here. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, no, yeah, I know, right? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Anyway, so, uh, yeah. Here is a code card for you guys, right there. Um, let's see what this turns out to be. Let's see if we can get something good out of this pack. One, two, three, and four to the front. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna go with Psychic Energy. No darkness this time. Wow, I got a reverse. Alright, Vulkner. Kranidos, a Lowland Dug Trio, Execute, Magnemite, Boo Weasel. Oh, and I dropped it. And oh, well, for a second I thought we got double Magnemite. No, there's just two in this set. Uh, Crow a Gunk. Uh, our reverse is a Gardenia, and our rare is a. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, we, we pulled all the good cards right at the beginning. Now we're not going to have any good pulls for the rest of the freaking pulls. Oh my god. And this one has got a good cut too. Yes. Jeez, guys. You guys are... Like, y'all are good luck. You all need to just... That's three pulls in a row. We got a hollow, a full art, and the freaking golden ticket. Oh my god. Oh my god, so one of you guys, I don't know which one of you is the best luck, but y'all gotta stay. All of y'all, because this is just... Oh my god. I know, right? So anyways, there is a code card for y'all, who any of you are watching for codes anyways. Oh, we only got three people watching right now, that's sad. Hmm. That's okay, Sure, I'm sure more people will show up. Either way, I'm having fun with whoever's here, so... Okay, let's start. I'm not even going to guess the energy anymore. Let's start off. Oh, Jesus. Palpad, Luxio, Shieldon, Gibble, Pachirisu, Yanma, Murkrow, 
EB, and ooh, and a reverse rare Magirna. Nice. And our rare is a Tapu Lele, and our first regular rare of this box. But whatever we get on this point out, it's just not even, it doesn't even matter because we got some of the best cards. Like, if we can pull, oh, hey, Shiny. Oh, it's okay. D oh, dude, dude, look, what, look at this. Look at this. First four packs. This is, these are my pulls. Like, so far. Like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> I melted down. Yeah, that was my second pack. I pulled the golden ticket. And I'm just... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay, I'm going to need a minute to call myself. I have never gotten that many pulls out of four packs before in my life. That is just the best. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's just make sure to, uh, you know, all thank Pokeball for this amazing box. <laughs> Oh. Okay, so we're calming down a bit. Um, let's, uh, oh, Jesus. I'm going to get a drink of water. i to get a drink of water. By the way, I got this. Uh, this is actually a cup that was made for me by uh, Kaylee Crane from Casey Crane. So, you know, unfortunately I don't make videos anymore, but she made me this. Mm. I know I got that uh, golden ticket just sitting there right on top of my stack right there because I can't stop looking at it. I, oh my god. <laughs> okay, y'all, let's see. We're going to go, like I said, full one of each arts. We got a Leafy on there. We got, oh, wow, we got lots of Leafy on in this, in this set. There's a Giratina, and there is our Don Wing. So, let's see. Last time, let's see, Leafy on paid off the most last time, so we're going to go with that first this time around. See if Leafy on is just going to be our good luck Pokemon this time around. And, uh, yeah, let's keep opening. Ugh. Man. It's also kind of kind of weird to think about that I've been doing this for, like, two years now. Actually, a little over two years. My uh, two-year was actually February 1st. But, yeah, my first videos actually weren't Pokemon. They were, uh, what you call it? I did some uh, Warhammer 40K stuff. I did some uh, painting. I did some Dragon Ball Z. And, uh, yeah, that was a lot of fun. But uh, it was when I uh, decided to get back into Pokemon that things picked up. And... It was pretty cool. I liked it. Let's see. On Mega, Palpad, I am just not functioning right now. Drifloon, I'm just like so excited. I'm just like throwing these cards around. It's just not even, <laughs> it's not even a thing. So there's like a tongue. Ooh, we got another reverse rare Magnazone. The cut on that is god awful though. Look at that. Jesus Christ. So I swear Pokemon needs to pick it up a bit. And we got a Frost Road and regular rare, but that's okay. That is a hit in my book, and more reverse rares for my master set are always, always appreciated. So let's see. Let's see what we got here. We got Zeratina. I think I'm pronouncing that right. I could be pronouncing it wrong. I am a special, special child. And let's see if I can get this get this going. Ah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's see if we can get something good. I want to get some more of those uh, prism cards, too. Ugh. Until you posted it, I didn't know you started. Yeah, I mean, I, yeah, I did. I think you started. You might have actually started after me. I'm not sure, actually. I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, are you a guy? Um, How do I explain that? Um... No, no, I'm 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 transgender. Uh, that's not uh, a secret on my channel. So I'm still in the process of transitioning. Uh, let's see, Lily, a uh, Lolan Diglett, a uh, month before me. Okay, that's night. Uh, Passimian, Shinx, uh, Cosmog Reverse, and our rare is a Frost Rotom regular rare. That's actually our first pack, and we didn't even get at least a reverse rare. So that's kind of sad. Alrighty, let's see. We'll see if uh, our uh, yeah. So let's see. Uh, Don Wings Necrozma. Wow. And hey there, JP3 Games. How's it going? <laughs> we have been getting some lit pulls. Just it's just not even like look. For those who just came in, this was second pack in. Second pack in. <laughs> yes, Giratina is a failure. 
So, yeah, very nice. And did I did I do the pack trick? No, I did not. So let's do our pack trick. One, two, three, and four to the front. And uh, yeah, oh look, we get someone we get to ban. Alrighty. Uh, Giratina, sorry, sorry. Hey there, Bill Bob. How's it going? <laughs> All right, Primplup, Gardena, Gabite, Gibble, Pachirisu, Yanma, Murkrow, Eevee, a Rockwind, that is a reverse rare, and our rare is a, hey, an Infernape Holographic. Very, very nice. We, oh, that's not bad. That's a double hit. That is pretty okay. Let's see, I know I pretty much have all the hollows in the set, I think, at this point. I don't think there's any I'm missing, but, you know, nice to get. Let's see if we can get something else. We haven't got pulled a Prism card yet, by the way. We should get a couple of those. Let's see, I don't think I pulled too many out of the last one. I think I only pulled two, maybe? Yeah, something like that. So we're starting off with a steel energy. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Heather, float soul, uh, Pokemon chat, and chill Twitter. Well, it's nice to see you here. You know, we're just having some fun, getting some great pulls. Some amazing pulls, actually. Our pulls have been at standing so far. I'm, like, worried we're not going to get anything else. Ooh, Buizel, and our rare is just an Araquanid regular rare. So, all right. That wasn't um wasn't so hot. I mean it wasn't bad, but you know we were failed by Giratina, unfortunately. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see what we got here. So we got four more packs. So yeah, let's see. I'm gonna do four more and we'll take a short break. So let's start off with uh Let's start with Don Wings Necrozma. I'm never gonna get those right. Like I'm gonna always have to stop to think about it. I'm just getting too old for this. I'm gonna be 33 years old this year, by the way. I'm not sure how I'm gonna deal with that. I'm pushing, starting to enter mid 30s territory, and it um scares me a little. A lot of existential anxiety, which is probably a little more than this channel I need to be talking about on this channel. But it is what it is. So. You know what, gamer girl? <laughs> I'm on you. Uh, Monferno. Uh, Pokemon Fan Club. Kranidos. Uh, Patrisu. Alolan Sandshrew. Alolan Vulpix. Uh, Bronzor. Dupider. Reverse Lily. Very nice. And our rare. <gasps> oh, jeez. <laughs> there we go. Full art Volkner. It's not the Cynthia that everybody wants, but that is still a very, very very cool pull so wow oh my god guys you guys just need to like bless all of my my pack openings from now on <laughs> oh Jesus all right let's see let's see what we got oh yeah we got Giratina. Yeah, congrats on two years. Yes, it was great. Ugh. Oh, yeah, lots of full art cards in this. <laughs> I'm getting. Oh, yeah, by the way, there is a code card for you guys right there. Have some fun. Hopefully, you guys are getting as lit of pulls as I am. So, let's see what we got here. And we got ourselves a Fighting Energy, Gabite, Looker Whistle, Prinplup, Magnemite. A weasel. <laughs> you know what? Just stop, Heather. Stop. Uh, Crohagunk. Bronzor. Palfad. And our reverse is just an Obama Snow. And that is okay. We got two more packs here for this little part. I mean, I know I'm only doing them a couple at a time, but I'm going to be needing to take a, a break here and there. Uh, let's we'll say we got Duskmane. And uh, because for those of you who do pack openings, y'all know how. Um, <laughs> so, Giratina. Yes, is it Giratina? Is that how we're supposed to pronounce it? <laughs> uh, how a 
it could be uh, pretty drying on the throat. So we'll we'll finish these two packs here, and we'll take like five minutes to chit chat, and so I can drink some water and keep going with the energy. I am going so freaking well. Ah, uh, damn! If I'm ever in Ohio again, I'm gonna need to go and give Pokeball a hug because this is the best box ever. <laughs> Magmar, Skunk Tank. Rosa Raid and oh yeah that's it that's, I didn't realize the skunk tank is um, that's just uncommon I didn't realize that that was my uh, reverse I didn't see the shiny I'm sorry guys I am a bad a bad Pokemon person so and now we got our leafy on and let's see what kind of pull we can get out of this so let's see one two three and four uh, let's see. You guys should try and guess to see what this is. Guess what kind of pull we're gonna get. Um, try to guess if it's gonna be a regular rare, hollow, um, GX, so on. Come on. <laughs> Tell him he said he's a gentleman. So I find the dark types to be hard to see our versus two. Yeah, absolutely. So, but still, very cool card. Uh, yeah. So we're turning slowly around. We're gonna do this one a little bit slow so we can uh, kind of build up some tension. Uh, we got ourselves a mana feat. A Grodal, a Yon Mega, a Lolan Diglett. Yeah, I love for an Ultra Rare. Last box, I only got one Ultra Rare, so this box is already a whole lot better than the last one. So, there we go. We haven't got any regular GX cards. I'd be pretty okay with that. Uh, Booneri, our reverse is a you know, Donald Trump Jr., and our rare is a <gasps> Leafeon GX. I actually already have this one, but you know what? That'll be used for trade bait. And you know what? This one has a pretty okay cut, a little bit too short on this side, but that is not bad at all. So, I mean, yeah, you, got, you called it ultra rare. I was thinking full arts, but all right, awesome. So, five minute break so I can um, keep up with the. Uh, Oh, goodness, my throat's actually getting a little bit sore. And as I was saying, you guys who do the pack openings, you got, y'all know what it's like when you do, like, marathon pack openings, especially if you're uh, filming in bulk. Oh, by the way, talk about filming in bulk. I got this to open this week. Very cool. Some of you guys probably saw that, the $40 uh, GameStop premium collection box. So... Sometime tonight, I will be filming that up, and that will be going up this week. It will be my only um, pack opening this week. I mean, I had a lot this week, but um, when you did the half box, I almost lost my voice by the end. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I bet you did. I mean, like I said, it's I, I could already feel it in the back of my throat. Yeah, $40. $40. And that's it. It's got the, um, what is all in this box? Yeah, it was, it's got the four promo cards, the little figurine, ten Shining Legends booster packs, uh, and of course it's got the special boxes in there, and of course the case itself is very high quality, so I am very, very excited to be opening that up um, later today. Yeah, the figures, uh, I believe that's how I just pronounced, oh my god, what is wrong with my hair? It's not staying down. The play mat, I already actually have uh, the play mat, but it was the one that I got, for, uh, got from... Um, Freaking uh, Southern Snorlax. <laughs> well, I just be sad for Sarah. He's a. Uh, I'm kind of sad that he's not making videos anymore either. But I can't quite blame uh, anyone who needs to, you know, stop doing it. This is expensive. It gets pretty hard. Fortunately for me, I have a pretty good job, so I can afford all this crap. But I mean, not and not everybody's making eighteen dollars an hour like I am. So it is what it is. Oh dear, let's see what else we got in here. Let's pull, let's pull some from this side. We're a little lopsided right here. So we got our Dusk, or Dawn Wings. Sorry, other, there's our Dusk Mane. And let's see if we can find another Giratina. Let's see. There we go, Giratina. I'm trying to pronounce this correctly just for you, Heather, just so you know. By the way, before, you know what, let's, before we go into our next little bit of a pack openings here. Let's, let's, geez, look at these pulls, like in this right here, this, oh my god, just, <laughs> oh, this is going right back on top, oh my god, this is already the best booster box I've opened in a long, long time, it might be the best one yet, so let's see, we're going to start off with a Garantina, 
Uh, oh, Tales from the Tabletop. Yes, I will. I got one uploaded. I just need to actually sit down and edit it. I need to edit the videos. The problem is, is that those files are so big that I'm having like issues getting it to uh, load properly on. Um, yeah, sorry. So, all right, I'll get them up. One, two, three, four. All right, so let's see. Let's get this going. Oh, we got ourselves a gumshoes, ancient crystal, uh, spirit tomb, stunky, young goose, magmar, a lowland diglet, sneasel. Our reverse is a snover, and our rare is a weavile holographic. Very nice. Very, very nice. I approve of that. You see, I kind of just have this pile of mess of cards just sitting over here right now because uh, it's like I already have those, so I don't care if they pile up all nasty. So, alrighty. Let's see if I can get some more decent pulls. Come on, guys. You guys have been good luck so far. We haven't pulled a prism card yet, and I'm definitely looking forward to pulling a prism card. One, two, three, and four. Come on, maybe we can get a double pull. Maybe we can get like a, a hyper rare and a prism, and maybe we'll open a pack that's nothing but full arts. I don't know. That'd be pretty sweet if that happened. So let's see. Execute a Magnemite Boezel. Uh, that is another reverse skunk tank, and our rare is just an Electrovire regular rare. So let's see if we can get some more. Let's see, we got ourselves some Dawn Wings. Let's see, come on, come on, come on, guys. You guys, you guys know I want you guys to bring me the pulls, so let's see, it's one, two, three, four. All right, so let's see if I did this correctly. <laughs> All right, there is our uh, Psychic Energy, Fire Memory, Order Pad, Drifflim, Sneasel, Eevee, I, just, I, I mention this a lot, but I just love the art on this. It is so freaking cute. I just want to reach in and hug it and make it my best friend. <laughs> uh, Magmar, uh, Morlow, Piplup, a reverse, ooh, a reverse rare, wow, 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 Wash Rotom, and our rare is, oh my god, a Dialga GX. I'm not sure if I have the regular version of this now. Did I, did I pull this? I can't remember now. But, you know, I got the full art version sitting over there, so very nice, very good pack. Oh my god, I swear, you guys, these, these these pulls are out of control. Oh my god, so we got the Leafeon pack last. Let's see <laughs> what we can get in terms of pulls, and there it is. That is your code card. So, oh, hey there, how's it going? I really wish I could pronounce your name correctly, but I don't think I can. Nuat, yes, Nuat, yes. I, I am not. I'm, I'm sorry, dude. But yeah, welcome to the live stream. So one, two, three, four. So let's see what we got here. We got ourselves an electric energy, fire memory, Grodel, Perugly, Turtwig, Electabuzz, Booniary, Morlo, Magmar. Our reverse is Torterra, that is a reverse rare, and our rare is a... <gasps> Are you serious? Another full art trainer, and a reverse rare. You guys, I need you around every time I open packs. This is just going to be how it is from now on. Uh, Poke, okay, Poke News in English. My real name is Kato Kaylee. Okay, yeah, all right? Jess, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> so out of those four packs, we got two ultra rares and I think two reverse rares. <laughs> I think we're, we're pulling all the good packs. There's like no way that we can get, because this is already better than my last box. This is just, and we still got quite a few packs to go. This is just ridiculous. So, I mean, hold on, let's just, let, let, let's let's do a quick recap so far. I'm gonna order these. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh Jesus Christ! So hold on. I'm just I'm like so nervous. I'm like shaking a little bit, guys. 
<sighs> oh, Jesus. Uh, there's another reverse rare. It's a hollow. Uh, okay, okay. So let's let's get these together so we can do ourselves a quick recap. I'm literally shaking y'all. Oh, well, yeah, it's kind of cool. Like, some people do that, uh, Heather. It's, you know, it is what it is. As long as you are having fun, that's what's important. And I want to point out that we're maybe only half a box in. And let's see what we got going here. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is from half a box, so we're we're not even even close to being done. We got the Araquanid, the Magnazone, the Torterra, Wash Rotom, Weavile, Magirna, Infernape, Magmortar, the Leafeon GX, the Dialga GX, the Full Art Volkner, the Full Art Dustming, the Krozma, the Full Art Lana, and of course our Golden Ticket. I mean, I'm just, I don't even understand what is going on with this box. Oh my god. So this is, oh, let me count one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight uh, hollows or better. And see, one, two. Oh, well, that's also a hollow, too. So that's nine hollows or better. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's a total of 14 pulls so far, y'all. Oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you, Giggly. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay, so let's get ourselves a drink of water. Oh my god. <laughs> oh Jesus. Alright, so let's let's just uh let's see, that's one, that's two three, and I am going to be knocking things over. I just you know what? I'm just not even gonna worry about that. I'm just gonna be pulling a Jess here and just knocking things over so you're gonna see like the nasty stain I have on the back of my wall so whatever it is what it is let's see where is that uh Giratina uh, ah there's another one all right we're all set okay so <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, sorry. Sorry, friend. No, I'm sorry for stealing your thunder. Oh, goodness. I am running out of room. Oh, goodness. <laughs> I'm getting so excited. I'm just not even paying attention. Okay, and let's see what we got in here. Come on. So, we haven't pulled a single prism card yet, by the way. So, there's a code card. Let me know. Let me know. I still don't have anyone that has never told me what they've gotten out of a uh, pack that uh, a code card that I've sent them. So or gave them through uh, through the videos. So you know, first time in the in the stream would be great. So, oh my God. Let's see how much farther. Okay, I'll see you later, Heather. Uh, you saw probably the best part of this box already. To be honest, I don't think we're gonna have much more after this. If, oh my god, there it is. There it is. That's it. The Cyrus Trainer card. That's the one with the uh, error on it. I'm not quite sure what the error is. If you play this card, if you don't have any water or steel type, you can't play this if you don't have any steel or water types. Your opponent chooses two bench Pokemon and shuffles the others, and all cards attached to them in the deck. Yeah, I can see why that's kind of complicated. And that is a regular rare guard charm. So, Jesus Oh my god, guys. I don't understand. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, the wording is really confusing on that. So, And because that was such an awesome pull, I'm going to give you guys this code card right here, too. So, Just because this box has been so amazing to me so far, I don't even know. Like I said, y'all need to be in every every time I open up cards. You guys got to be here because I'm. You guys are giving me the pulls. If I remember, 
Grodel. Uh, let's see, that's a per ugly. You know, it's not really that ugly though. I think it's kind of cute in its own weird little way. A uh, Turtwig. A Rosilia. Gibble. Electabuzz. Chimchar. Turtonator. And that is just an uncommon. And our rare is a Mo Rotom regular rare. So, uh, a little bit more variety here. Uh, and after I do this, I'm going to have to find a better way to stack these. Let's see, we got our ugh, our Duskmane. Let's get this open. Let's see, come on. Alrighty, let's get going. Come on, let's see. Can we pull another Prism card? Can we pull another Hollow? Maybe another GX? We are already so far above average that I, I can't... If we pull nothing else, I'm not going to be upset. So, let's see, Cherum... Gumshoes, Carnivine. Uh, my favorite Pokemon is Victini, and also Hello fifteen nine eight two. Thank you for showing up to the stream. Uh, Magnemite, Snover, Glamio. Our reverse is a Cynthia. I think that might be the first one we pulled in here. And our rare is just a Hippodon regular rare. That's actually still a hit because that's actually worth a bit of money. But yeah, Victini is my favorite Pokemon. And let me um switch over to the scene real quick so you can see better. See, as you can see, D Queen Victinis, that was my uh, Pack Battle League team. So, you know, I like it quite a bit. So, alrighty, let's see if we can get something decent here. Let's see. Come on, we're gonna open this pack up and see if we can get something good. Alright, come on, I need you guys to win. Oh, yeah? Awesome, it's a great Pokemon, so. Like, I remember when I first got black, oh, was it was black and white, which one did I get? I don't remember if I got black or white. I think I got white version. And you were able to, you had like that um, initial gift where you can pick up a Victini like right away. And it was such a great Pokemon. And uh, <laughs> Jamie Awesome just texted our group um, that, you know, I just fell absolutely in love with it. So it's kind of been my favorite ever since. Let's see, Electabuzz, our reverse is Shield on and our rare. You gotta be, you gotta be freaking kidding me. This is, I mean, I guess yeah, none of them are Cynthia, which would have been the best, but oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my god. This is our fourth full art from this box. Like, Jesus, man, y'all buy all of your packs from freaking Pokeball from now on. Just, like, don't even, oh, my God. Oh. Draw two cards. If you discard a random card from your opponent's hand, yeah, that's a pretty good card, too, in its own, in its own right. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to set these aside real quick. Um, can't, listen, I don't know where this luck is coming from, girl. I... Oh my god, I am going to have to like literally go through and calculate the value of this box just because they, the pulls have been so good. And what, what's my, why is my Dialga GX all the way over here? Oops. Oh, oops. Oh my god. Oh uh, yeah, oh yeah, this has so many good cards in this set. And I need to organize this better so that it's not much of a mess, but I don't... Let's see, I'm just going to kind of... Oh, I'm knocking more things over. I am... This is... This is something else. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I am just kind of in the process of uh, re-evaluating the way I have this stuff all st stacked over the side. Uh, let's see, Lucario GX. I don't think I have that one. That would be pretty cool to pull. Uh, you know, and I keep saying that I don't think we're gonna get any more pulls, and then we get more pulls. So, you know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna count anything out at this point. We still got got about half a box left. No, well, a little less than half a box. And how much uh, Tapu Lele GX is worth? I have two. So, uh, yeah, that is actually about right. Uh, Tapu Lele is probably the most valuable card in the set right now. 
Um, may well, maybe the full art. Cynthia might be worth more, but uh, yeah, Tapu Lele, even the regular one goes for about $60. The full art and rainbow versions can go anywhere from uh, $70 to $90, depending on uh, how badly someone wants it. Let's see. All right, so I've got less of a mess now. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 it's a valuable card. No, even the regular version is worth a lot of money. So, yeah, no, Tapu Lele is the most sought-out card right now. Because you play it from your hand, you can pull whatever trainer you want, and that's that is powerful. Oh, there we go. Okay, so let's have the teeny chilling over here. You can just you can just sit over there. So all right, so we are uh, about ready to get back to some pack opening. So and uh, yeah, let's see. Let's go back to painting stream. But yeah, like just from those four packs, that is. That is pretty impressive. I mean, I realize that's not the full art Cynthia, but that is still worth some money. I think that's going to get you five or six dollars right there. And of course, the Cyrus, which is the one prism I wanted because it was a misprint. So let's see. From here on out, I'm not going to bother with the uh, pack type because we're running low on different types. It actually ended up happening anyways. So there you go. We're going to start off with the Giratina. Oh my god. I only have uh, the one Zerka Tree full art. No, that's not bad though. That's amazing. I sell one. Yeah, I mean, if you want to sell one, you know, especially if you don't need it, you're not using it in your deck or anything like that, you might as well get some cash for it. So, anyways, so because we had such an amazing pool there, there we go. Let me know. Let me know. I want to know what you guys getting from your co cards. So, there we go. One, two, three, four. And this is literally the greatest booster box of all time. Like, just hands down, I've never had pulls like this from a booster box. I am so glad I decided to buy this. Oh my god. And, um, Jesus. Gibble, Pachirisu, Yanma, Murkrow, Stunky, and a Raquinid regular rare. So, no luck on that one. That's okay. We got a couple more packs here. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Still, that being said, uh, Jess, I am still very jealous that you pulled that uh, Cynthia full art. I really wanted that card. And, like, I pulled three full art trainers, and not one of them is Cynthia. <laughs> anyway, so we're starting off with our fairy energy, a stunt tank, a skunk tank. Ugh. I remember when I was the only one in streams. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, well, I d don't do them very often, but it's kind of nice to see that uh, my channel's kind of grown up enough that I can have streams and um, have a reasonable audience. <laughs> Glad you're still around, though, friend. And our rare is just a Wash Rotom. Yeah, we might be finally getting at that point in which we're not going to have uh, fairly decent pulls anymore. Uh, just simply because, I mean, come on. Like, I, I know I keep saying that we can't possibly get any more pulls, and then we do, but it had I just had to be grabbing the right ones. And even then, we still have far above average pulls. This is just this is just something else. So, all right, starting off with a Darkness Energy Rotom, a Unit Energy, Cosmoem, a Bow Weasel. Uh, there are some cards in there that look fake. I don't know how to tell... Tell it looks real, but well, I mean, I can um, I can help you with that later. If you want to get hold of me at Twitter, I can look. I can usually tell when cards are fake or real. There are a couple of tips. So, all right, yeah. Just uh, be careful about that because it's possible. I remember fake Pokemon cards are a thing that going all the way back. I remember I started collecting back in base set over there, back when I was I was in middle school, and um. I wish I still had my uh, complete base set uh, set that I had. I had the whole set, and uh, <laughs> it was great. But um, I remember once my mom brought us uh, brought us some of what she thought were booster packs, but they were like these little cardboard sleeves, and the cards were like half the size of the uh, regular ones. And I'm like, "What are these, mom? These aren't real Pokemon cards." And they were they were really bad fakes. And uh, the ones now are much much better. Magnemite, Weasel, 
Magnemite. We get a lot of Magnemites. Croagunk. Our reverse Honkro. And our rare is a, a, a Remp Ardos Holographic. Very nice. Very, very nice. At least we ended with a hollow on that one. And, um... But yeah, fakes are kind of a plague, but there's a couple things you can look for uh, if you're dealing with fakes. Uh, one thing to check, I mean, one is to make sure that the packaging looks real, and obviously there is some that comes in like with real looking packaging. Um, but sometimes they'll come in like cardboard boxes, and that's not how it's supposed to come. Uh, and one of the good things with the cards is that they haven't seemed to figure out how about that black bit in between the poo pieces. Yes, that's another way to tell is to take like just one of the common ones and then rip it in two. There should be like a layer of ink in between the two to kind of tell. Um, another way if you don't want to tear it is the light test. Hold it up to a light bulb and if the light shines through, like you see some of the light, that is a sign that you have a fake card. So, I mean... Look out for them. They're not as common as people think. It's not, uh, most places won't sell them, but I remember making a video a while back where I found a bunch of them being sold at a very fancy fashion mall here in Chicago. Like, this was a store where they sold purses that were like two to three thousand dollar purses, and yet here's this guy peddling fake Pokemon. Ugh. It was something else. And, uh, let's see. We're gonna go back to the, uh, paint stream. All right, so four more packs. Like I am just like I know I'm kind of rushing through this box. I thought it would take longer, but you know, well I mean we're pushing an hour already, and that's more than I want to go. Or I mean I, I don't want to go super long, but um, let's see. Also the colors in the packs are usually weird, and they have blurry writing on them. Yes, absolutely. Check the font. See see if they have like some stupid number for the hit points. Like sometimes they'll have like ten million hit points or just something ridiculous. That's usually a sign, but those ones are usually so far out there that you can usually tell right off the bat whether or not it is a fake. So, let's see. What can we get in this pack? Come on. We're finally running low on Steam. <laughs> Rotom, Driftbloom, Magmar, uh, Chimchar, Sneasel, Lickitung. Carnivine, a reverse Magmar, very cool, and ooh, and a Shaman. I love that Shaman, by the way. It's such a cool art. There's actually two uh, rare Shamans in this set, and they're both very neat, and they are actually kind of a little harder on to pull for, as far as the regular ones row. You get a lot of those Mo Rotoms. It seems like the Mo Rotoms are that that rare they have that show up a lot. They're usually in group, like the Oricorios or what have you. And you just pull them all the time. That being said, it's a little bit different than how it usually is. Usually when you do something like that, you get, like, monkeys, and I, people can't stand those freaking monkeys. Look at the photos from that. It's the same, and it's crisp. So, yeah, you're probably pretty good. If you're really unsure, send me a picture of it on Twitter over DM, and I will look at it for you. Uh, but you're, you're probably good. So, anyways. Energy. Rotom. Unidentified Fossil. And another thing to tell if you're opening up a fake pack is sometimes they'll put like three or four ultra rares in every pack, or sometimes they'll all be ultra rares, and it's 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 just something else. You know, what? I don't think we've pulled a Toxie yet, so let's uh, well, I mean, let's not uh, jinx ourselves as a Cranidos, and our rare is a Luxray holographic. Nice, I love the art on that one. Good cut, very pretty. Ooh, I love it. Wow, awesome. We've got two more packs here. Come on, let's see if we can get just a couple more, maybe a couple more GX cards, maybe a couple more prisms. I will take whatever. And that's a white code card. I'm just letting you guys know right now that that is a white code card. So we're getting at least another hollow after these four packs, and I still got one more. Oh, man. So good luck so far. No hashtag Toxic Squad, Turtonator, Shinx, Carnivine. Murkrow, Magnemite, Snover, Glamiao, and our rare is, oh, it is a Shaman Holographic. Yes, I told you there was another Shaman in this set, and ooh, it is so pretty. Oh, uh, man, that's actually a, not a bad card. Search your deck for up to three different basic Pokemon types and put them on your bench, and then show, yeah, I mean, I there's something about, about Shaman cards, and they're always about, you know, getting more, uh, you know, stacking your bench however you want it, so even those, I mean, they're not the Shaman from back in the day, but 
Uh, one of them wasn't in mint condition that I would keep had a corner cut off, but it was a black piece inside. I was worrying that meant it was fake. No. Yeah, the shaman is cute, and no, that little black piece inside is actually a sign that it's real. So, I do want to point out that sometimes quality isn't the best indicator that we're dealing with official products, because official products have gone down in quality pretty bad as of late, so I wouldn't, um... I wouldn't use that as a standard, so let's see, one, two, three, and four to the front. Let's see if we can get ourselves some good pulls. Lotzel, Missing Clover, uh, Turtonator, Croagunk, lots of Croagunks, no Toxies yet, Eevee, Alolan Vulpix, that is probably the best Alolan Vulpix art to date though, I love it. I really love the more abstract, unusual arts over the more standard arts, personally. Shinx, oh, reverse shield on, and our rare is an Electivire regular rare. All right, so let's see. Uh, let's see. Let me clean up all these wrappings, by the way. Oh, I got a lot of wrapping. I got to be a little bag down here. Toss them into that disappeared for some reason. So they're just gonna go in my little trash bag over there. I'm gonna have to pick up the rest of these here just a bit. Where did that little bag go? Oh my god, how do I do this? Someone explain why Cass does these things. Yep, yep, almost certainly. I mean, like I said, if you open the packs, and if in those packs it wasn't like multiple GX cards per pack, or something like that, or if you weren't getting like one after another, it, it probably was. not You're probably pretty lucky. Like, it's not impossible. Like I said, I've pulled two uh, Papu Leles. It happens. Some people, you know, like the card is pretty desirable and some people just are able to pull, you know, card after card. So, all right, let's go back to our paint stream. And I keep calling it paint stream because that's what it's labeled and oh my god, let me... There we go. Jeez. Uh, I'm like getting so excited, I'm like knocking my camera around and stuff like that. Oh my god. So, let's get the next four. One two, three, and four. All right, so we got a lot of Leafeons here, so we're gonna have ourselves a Leafeon sandwich right there in the middle. And let's see, come on, let's see, we still got, yeah, we got a total of eight packs left. So let's let's see if, what, what kind of pulls we can get in this last bit of stretch. Who knows, could be something good. Could be something bad, mind you, but you know, it could be something good. We could not pull another pull. Honestly, if we don't pull a single thing in these remaining packs, I am going to say that we have done outstanding, and this is by far the best booster box opening, you know, I have yet. yet. So everything else from this point on, and there's another Cynthia, uh, is a, um, is just, it's just gravy. Oh, it's a $15 for a random lot? Okay. Well, yeah, I mean, random lots are, aren't too bad. That's a, uh, you never know with those. Sometimes, a lot of times when they sell random lots, they will put a, is it, that's just an uncommon, they'll have a chance to uh, pull something pretty awesome just because they know that people are going to be more likely to buy them that way, even though the odds aren't necessarily great. So let's see, come on, let's just get one pull from each of these, and I will be pretty excited. I want one more prism card. I really want another, I really like those. One, two, three, four. All right, so we're starting off with a fire energy. Maybe we'll also finally get our toxic rope. Like that'll be a pretty good pull if we can get a toxic rope, right, Jess? Uh, Yan Mega, Drifloon. Uh, oh, is it? Is this India worth more? Yeah, I'm not surprised. Um, that's a pretty good card. I would have figured that the Lele would have got it, but I was wrong. Croagunk. Oh, Chimchar looking so cute, and our revert, our regular rare is a Salazzle regular rare. So, come on, we got two packs here. We got four more in the box. Come on, guys, let's let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can uh, see if we can get some pulls. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Let's get this out of here. And anyways, uh, you know what? I'm gonna give you guys this code card as a sacrifice to the poke gods let's see if that can bring me some more luck in these last few packs one two three four all right come on guys yeah yeah i know poor jess <laughs> oh my god wouldn't that just be the perfect box of all these pulls and not a single toxic rogue like can you even imagine like cause i kind of agree with you it's actually a creepy looking pokemon piplup salandit 
Passimian. Shinx. Oh dear. Execute. Oh, Eevee. That's the other Eevee card. Uh, Palette of Friends. Oh, that's a nice attack. And a Tapu Lele. Speak of the Devil. Uh, I'm not sure how good the rare Tapu Lele is, but I like the art on it. I like the art quite a bit. So we got one more pack here. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Whoever it is that's giving me all of this luck, please continue to give me the luck. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, and four to the front. Come on. Come on. We can do this. We can do this, guys. I believe in me. I believe in this box. I believe in the heart of the cards and all of that jazz. Let's see. Electric memory right there. Stunky. Turtwig. Electabuzz. I'm going so fast I don't realize that there's a... It's not focusing very well. Well, we're going to make do with that. So, Benary. More lol. Ooh, a reverse rare heat. Rotom, very nice, and an Alolan Slash, Sand Slash, at least we got another Reverse Rare, we get a lot of those in this set, that's pretty nice, so we're down to our last four packs, so what do you guys think, let's see, oh look, it actually ended up working out because we got one of each pack art for our last opening, so we're going to start off with Giratina, I think, uh, let's see, is it me because I've been here the whole time, yeah, I'm going to assume that Jess is my good luck charm, oh my god, this. Oh my god, oh my god. And here we go. Come on, guys. Let's hope for just a few more pulls, guys. Just a few more. One, two, three, and four. Oh my god, Jess. Bring me that luck, Jess. <laughs> oh my god. I'm going to start. Oh my god. Floatzel. Skunk Tank. Hiplop. I can't even pronounce the words correctly just because. Oh my god. Gibble. Dupider, Sneasel Reverse, and our rare is, hey, a Cresselia Hollow. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I hope that isn't our last pull, though. Come on, we want one more decent pull before we go out. Oh, goodness. I mean, who knows? Who knows? We still got a couple more packs here. We don't know what kind of luck you're going to bring, girl. So, all right. So, let's start off with a Fighting Energy. Uh, Spirit Tomb, Rotom, Unit Energy, Chimchar, Sneasel, Lickitung, Carnivine. Oh my god, I see something. At <gasps> what? Yes! <laughs> a second Cyrus Prism card? And that is just a fan Rotom. What is that? Oh my god. That, that's the first time I've ever got two of a, of a, like, like a special kind of rare in a box like that. Like, cause, wow, all right. Nice, thanks for the luck. We got two packs left. Whatever we get is whatever we get. Oh, geez, so, all right. We got, oh my God, we got Dustmane. Let's, let's just get going. There is a code card for you guys right there. Let me know, let me know, let me know what we can do to... Oh my god. <laughs> oh jeez. We are doing so freaking well today. This isn't even... Like, it doesn't even matter what else I get, like, at this point. Whatever I get, it's just been the best freaking box I've ever opened. Shenotic is oh that is a reverse rare, so yeah, and Drapion. And we got one pack left. Last pack. Let's see what we can get. Let's hope we don't get that freaking Toxic Croak. Let's see what we get. One, two, three, and four. And yeah, so we're starting off with a psychic energy, fire memory. A uh, Bronzong, Missing Clover, Glamia, a Drifloop, a Lowland Sandshrew, Hippopotus, Riolu. Oh, Jesus. There we go. G Giratina. Oh, Prism. Oh, my God. And a Hippodon, so congratulations to Jess for not only being good luck 
but in an entire box, not one toxic rogue. Let's, um, oh Jesus, uh, let me go back over. We're gonna do one heck of a recap here. Oh my God. Um, I, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Like, I'm, I'm just... <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, let's get that weave out in its proper spot. Okay, there we go. Oh, my God. Let's say, oh, I got quite a few hollows out here, too. Yeah, a lot of hollows. Let's see. There's my reverses. And let's see. Oh, yeah, there's another hollow. Another reverse. Yeah, Jesus. So, yeah. For y'all who, uh, <laughs> who open packs, oh, we all know who's good luck around here. This is, this is something else. Like, <sighs> I mean, save for getting a Cynthia, I don't think it's possible to have had, gotten a better box. Yeah, I know, right? What a day not to have sleeves. So let's, let, oh my god, look at the stack of pulls here, by the way. What is that? So we're starting off with an Araquanid, Hollow, or Reverse, Shenotic, Reverse, Magirna, Reverse, Wash Rotom, Reverse, Totera, Reverse, Magnazone, Reverse, Heat Rotom, Reverse, uh, Cresselia, Hollow, Luxray, Hollow, Rampardos, Hollow, Shaman, Hollow, Magmortar, Hollow, Infernape, Hollow, Weavile, Hollow, Cyrus, Prism, Cyrus, Prism, Giratina, Prism, Dialga GX, Levion GX, Mars, Full Art, Lana, Full Art, Volker, Full Art, Duskmane, Necrozma, Full Art, and of course, the number one pull of this box, the Lunala GX Golden Ticket. Look at that. Let me count how many pulls that was. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and that is seventeen pulls out of thirty-six packs. That that is almost one in two hollows or better. Yeah, yes, exactly. And then when we count the reverse rares, we have one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven reverse rares. So that's a total of 24 reverse rare or better. That is definitely over, well over. Yeah, I mean, that's one and two. Like every other pack was a pull. That, oh my god. And you know what the best part about this is? We still got one more pack to open, don't we? <laughs> oh my god. This is this is something else. Like, do you guys even know how long it's been? Yeah, from one box. This was just one box, guys. This is one box. 17 hollow or better. That is just surreal. I think my ultra rare was like something like... Oh my god, let me count how many ultra rares I have explicitly. So let's see, just ultra one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's ten ultra rares. So like that's almost that's almost one in three ultra rares. So it's like a little over yeah, a little over a quarter. Yeah, these were what I had back in the day. And I'm just gonna one thing I'm gonna say is that this is gonna be the one and only base set booster pack that I'm gonna open on my channel. Too many of these things are getting opened. I just want one last time to open base set. So, just one last time. Oh, it's beautiful. I paid quite a bit of money for this, and I'm probably just gonna get cards that are only worth a couple cents. It's gonna be the rare is gonna be a trainer, and because uh, there's no way this isn't weighed at this point. But yeah, pretty excited about that. Uh, one real quick thing. I'm gonna take a break real quick. I'm gonna go. Yeah, right. I hope I get something good too. But um I'm not counting on it. This is just gonna be just nostalgic time, just 
just open it up with an old booster pack like I did. I haven't, yeah, keep all your base sets, but that is glorious. Yeah, I'm going to get more in the future, but I'm going to keep them sealed. But I haven't opened one of these since the year 2000, so we're going on 18 years since the last time I've opened up a base set booster box. So, and uh, I just got a message from Jonathan. And uh, let's see what is someone someone saying something on here. Someone's talking about me. Uh, let's see. Yes. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna open a base set pack here. All right, I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break though, and then when we get back, we're gonna open the the base set. All right. Uh. Yeah, I caught saw my last vid and came right over. Yeah, sorry. Um, I have a this. I thought this would last longer, but those pulls were amazing. All right, I'm gonna be right back. Gonna gonna. What if I get a first edition? I don't know. I'd probably keep that seal because those are so expensive that it's not really worth it. So I'll be right back. One second, guys. All right, let me know if you guys can hear me, because I am now back. Ugh. All right, so let me know when uh, when y'all are back. Um, so we could, uh, by the way, Flame, I will sub to you after this. And, um, okay, awesome, so everything's going through. Uh, just making sure everyone's here who wants to be in here. All right, so, oh man, this is gonna be pretty darn exciting. So, look up, and let me make sure I have my OBS up so I can see what I'm doing here. And that is, oh Jesus, look at that. Just look at the back. Give you guys a chance to read the words on there. See what I said. The highly successful Pokemon Game Boy game was just the beginning of the Pokemon phenomenon. Now with this trading card game, you can train your favorite Pokemon to pit against a rival's Pokemon in a fight to the finish. Can you become the world's number one Pokemon master? Master the Pokemon trading card game and find out the Pokemon trading card games. Easy to learn, fun to play, recommended for players age 10 and up. Oh my god. Like I just remember when this came out and how hard it was to get packs at times. Because they just sold so well. Premium cards, 1 in 33. So we have a 1 out of 3 chance of pulling something. So, Okay, guys. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? Let me know if you're ready for this. Because I'm, I'm, I'm just so nervous about opening this. And, uh, oh my god. I am so nervous. I have not opened one of these in so long. Oh, goodness. Let's see, I'm gonna try and preserve the pack as much as possible. So I'm gonna try and open it up from the bottom here. Oh my god, this thing has been sealed for the better part of 20 years now. That's so old. Oh, so retro. I remember the one day that I pulled the uh, when I pulled the Charizard Hollow. I was walking home from 7-Eleven. I went to buy my mom a soda and I had my allowance, so I had bought the pack. I couldn't wait to open it. I opened it right over there. I got so excited. I literally tripped. Like, you don't even know how excited I was from that. Oh, my God. This is just so, so amazing. 
This is such a good feeling. Like, oh my god, I feel like I'm just a kid again. You know, just without the stress of bills and all that good stuff. Ugh. Of course, when I was a kid, I just tore these packages opening, open, not thinking about what the value was, but there we go. That is, that is beautiful. There we go. I think that's about as well as I'm pres Oh my god, just, there we go. Look at that, look at that. Yep, 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 yep. Let's see if I can get it. I know this is going to sound a little weird, but like one of my favorite things about trading cards is their smell. So I'm curious if, if they still have that smell. Oh yeah, they still they still do. Oh my god. I preserved that pack like immaculately. Like there's that little bit of inner fold that came off, but oh my god, look, just they feel so different. Like they they're so much thicker. Oh my god. Oh my god, I got I gotta get to give this thing a sniff again. I'm sorry I'm being weird. Oh my god. <laughs> you guys, this is such a good day. Like I don't even care what I don't have to get a decent pull out of this. And one, two, three, and to the front. And, or not to the front, but the thing. Alright guys. Come on, Jess. So come on, Jess. You gotta bring me the bring me the goods one last time. Abra, oh my god, these cards are so amazing. Oh my god, I just love these so much. I had the complete base set. Yeah, I had the complete base set. And I ended up uh, giving it away to uh, a kid when I was uh, when I was a teenager. And um, I don't regret it because the kid was really sick. But sometimes I still wish I had that set. They got the Ivysaur. Full heal. This is it. Here's the rare, and it is a, a Clefairy doll. Nice. So yeah, I didn't think it was gonna be much. It certainly wasn't gonna be worth. Oh no, you know what? The, the, the price of entry was worth just being able to. Oh my God, no, it's no Charizard. <laughs> I wish that would have been amazing. No, 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 I'm not even worried about that. Actually, regular holographic Charizards aren't too terribly expensive, so it won't be too bad for me to purchase it. So. Either way, oh my god. That being said, this this booster box just Jesus. What else do we need? Like, oh my god, so <laughs> Alright guys, that was so much fun. So yeah, I know, that's what I'm saying. Just opening it up was great. I just so glad I had the chance to open that up. And uh, <laughs> like I'm not even upset that I didn't get a hollow. I'm just like, yeah, look how cute that is. That is adorable. I want a Clefairy doll that looks just like that one. Oh my god, I would just lose my mind if I did. But either way, guys, I hope you guys had fun. I mean, this was just the best opening ever. This is like my best ever Pokemon opening, and I'm just so glad that I got to share it with you guys. So. <laughs> Oh man, um, yeah, definitely. And for those of you who are new, make sure to subscribe. You know, this is this is the kind of excitement we get on my channel. I get all excited. I get to have my little meltdown over it, and I'm glad you had a great time, Jess. And um, but yeah, the best way to follow me is on social media at on Twitter at Jedi underscore Cast and on Facebook at Cast the Nerd. And if you want to talk to me directly about anything at all, it doesn't matter. Just let me know and I'll ha happily have a conversation with you about Pokemon or anything. I've been really into Overwatch lately, so if you're going to want to talk about Overwatch... Oh, thanks for the sub, uh, Flame, by the way. I really appreciate that. That is so awesome. I'll be sure to sub back to you two here in just a bit. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this stream. I had a lot of fun. I'm definitely going to do this again. I'm not sure when. Uh, maybe when I can get another booster box or something like that. Yeah, oh, thanks, Falcon. I know I'm pretty pretty awesome. I'm an awesome person. And uh, let's see. Let me go back to the scene here real quick. So, yeah, definitely be sure to check out. I'm going to have more Tales from the Tabletop up soon. For those of you who don't know, that is my Dungeons & Dragons series. I am way behind on it, but that's just because it's really hard to edit. Um, yeah, definitely. And do, I, I appreciate, I do one, two, three, five, I appreciate that too. I will sub to you as well. 
Uh, open a Team Skull collection. Yes, I haven't gotten one of those. Um, I might. That might be a thing I might do every now and then. Is just get like a set some box sets or something like that, and then. You know, once I get a bunch of them, and then I can do a stream where we just do a big opening, and you know, we have a good old time about it. So yeah. Anyways, I got to go wash some dishes, and then I gotta go get some uh, pasta sauce so I can make myself some dinner, and because I can't have pork chops every night. <laughs> and yeah, I will see you nerds in the next video. Later.